The Elgato HD 60S Plus allows you to stream and record video from various sources. Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Mr. Gim here, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you something called the Capture Card, which this is from Elgato. After a very long time research about Capture Card, I finally have my hand on this right here. I would like to say this could be probably the best Capture Card HD. The HD 60S Plus, now you may be wondering what is the S stands for. And honestly, I have no idea what does it mean. They did not really say it in the document or whatever. So I would like to think that it the S stands for speed is referred to USB type C because this device could be the first game catcher HD that featured USB type C connection as all the previous game catcher card only features slower than USB 2.0 and as you will see later it makes a difference when you are previewing your live stream now let's get into the unboxing Over here you get to see the quick setup guide which is the USB type C to your capture card and USB type A to your computer followed by the HDMI to your PS4 after that output to your monitor screen there you go inside the box there's the capture card itself the HD 60S plus and a USB type C to a USB type A and a HDMI cable you also have a sticker and some documentation now but the documentation does not have anything relevant i would say all right so usb type c 3.0 and the instant game view provide you the real-time preview of your live stream actions and now it does require a faster computer elgato is actually recommending a quad core computer when you are using this feature on your hd 60 s plus so you may want to make sure that your computer can handle that and if not you can always buy a older or other brands of capture card if you are using a mac the usb type a connection meaning you will still need a dongle for your macbook pro unless you are using a usb type c to usb type c cable And lastly, there's an HDMI cable that connects whatever input source to your where you're capturing from. Now, before you can start using the HD 60s Plus, you're going to need to download the Elgato Capture HD software. It's from their website. This software allows you to record and stream. Your capture input can be instant as you can connect your game console like your PS4 or your Dento Switch or you can also connect a camera like Sony or GoPro and that's actually what I'm going to do in this example. So once you have the software downloaded, simply connect your USB cable to your HD 60s Plus. Light up like that and then it's just a matter of connecting your HDMI cable to your software. The advantage of this HD 60S Plus is the USB Type C to USB Type 3.0 connection is much more lower latency on the live stream. Since now I'm connecting directly to my router, I'm going to go ahead and stream this at 1080 by 60 frames per second. If I connect through Wi-Fi, I would make it less. But you can see right here, I have a set of 1080p by 60 because I'm connecting directly to my network so I can go in here and make sure all my setting is correct and I can also choose which service that I want to stream to whatever you want and you can do that with ease YouTube, Facebook, etc. So one of the other cool things that this capturing software comes with is that you can add those overlay 
right here in the bottom of the screen and you can actually edit those overlay and show your video or images which you can see over here there is twitch you need to do is just to click at this little button right here and then you can choose to get scene at image at video if you want to do so you can add this to your overlay but i'm not gonna go too in depth on this if let's say you guys want me to go in depth probably let me know in the comment section below or thumbs up this video so i would know so ladies and gentlemen that is the 1080p 60 frame per second live stream on facebook courtesy of the elgato software and the capture card hd software is super easy to go live on youtube twitch or facebook if you guys are interested in gaming check out my newly created page at gamester gaming i'm new in doing live so just give me a little support all right guys that's the end of my video if you have any questions feel free to write in the comment section below subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video okay thanks bye